yeah, consignment no, of goods produced that one works. time. It's not incorrect. It's not incorrect. Oh, that's France. That's France, right? Okay, oh, I was going to say, like... I'm pretty sure that's France. That's France, right? I'm worse. No, I, that's, I, I see, I'm like, I see yeah, Dr. I'm Mario pretty, I'm sure that's France. On the CSS. I've actually... You know, I've never actually met France. I don't think we've actually, like, spoken. Mm. But I have seen a lot of friends and obviously a lot of player cams and stuff like that. So I'm pretty sure you're right. And by the way, uh, dude, what the hell? This is a crazy set. Fat Goku versus France? I'm just realizing, like, dude, these are two, like... It would not be that weird for either one of these two players to be in top eight. At, actually, yeah. Actually, I can see that. So I think I heard. Uh, I mean, with some up, with some ups, it's granted. Sorry. Yeah, but yeah. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, I think this. These are seeds 32, 33, if I heard correctly. Oh, so it's, this is about. This is the closest we're gonna get in terms of seed when it uh, comes to this part of the bracket. Then. Yeah, I, I think so. 32 versus 33. I think so. They're one off, right? Um, because the the winner of this does make top tw uh, top 64. Excuse me. And that's why this Jesus. is a best of five. So here we are. So I think, you know, I will say overall, like, Fat Goku, there was, like, a period Ooh. where I felt like Fat Goku was entering a lot more majors and was, like, extremely active. Um, these days have taken a little bit of a backseat in terms of, like, the, the, the major scene. I feel like you don't see, like, Fat Goku at every single major the way you did for a while. But um, Franz, on, on the other hand, uh, <laughs> we've seen a lot of lately just with some really incredible results with the Dr. Mario. Oh, yeah. And Nair does get stronger the longer it's out. Now, I want to know if these two played each other because, you know, the funny thing is, I remember there was a tournament where these two, they almost played each other. I believe Fat Goku might have lost to Sechi, and then I think the winner had Franz. Or oh. maybe it was that, maybe it was, or, or like, well, Sechi beat one of them and lost the other one. I, I don't remember which, which, it was like, it was Genesis like five, I think. Yeah, it was at um, Genesis. It was at Genesis. I do remember that. Right. And that was like, you know, a couple years ago <sighs> at this point. Mm hmm. Yeah. That was a while ago for sure. Right. Yeah, I mean, France has uh -oh. been you're gonna all over. Oh, B? dude, I no does he? Okay, that. Way. Oh, he's and it's so KO. extended. No way. It, dude, what the, bro, France? Okay, so, dude, when I watch France, like, I feel like <sighs> France is a genius of this character. 100% a hundred percent agree. Genius. I have seen France just use. Dr. Mario's hitboxes in ways oh, okay. that I feel like they shouldn't work, right? They're just kind of missing Randall, but like, dude, I've seen friends like just use up B on reaction to beat like Falcon, or up B, up air on reaction to beat Falcon there. Like getting in between the hits with the little like stubby little Dr. Mario up air, like just a master of this character's small hitboxes. That's gonna be uh. game one in a very commanding fashion for friends. I think. Yeah, that, that's definitely it. It doesn't feel like Franz bulldozes his opponents or anything like that. It just feels like he has all the right ideas at all the right times, and he does them in very surprising ways. Like, I'm constantly surprised by him. Okay, he went... Okay, even right there, even though it didn't work, he went for, like, just reading that Fat Goku was going to run in front of him and do an up -E cancel just to attack that space in front of him. Like, mm -hmm. stuff like that, that, like, I don't think anyone has ever even attempted before. Dude, I was talking to actually a good buddy of ours, Kirby Kaze, recently. Wow. Uh, when I was, I was, yeah, I was just in Toronto, ah. and I, we, I stopped by Kirby Kaze's place, and we had lunch. Oh, cool. That's and awesome. we were talking about friends for some reason, um, and I want to know what you think of this because Kirby Kaze had a funny theory about Franz's skill set as a player, mm. and basically said. I think Franz is the cactuar of Dr. Mario. <laughs> Franz uh, is good at all the same, like, huh. doesn't, isn't a very heavily, like, set play oriented player. Like, you're never going to see Franz get, you know, the perfect Dr. Mario chain grab on, like, a Sheik or something. But huh. kind of a, like, neutral monster, like, pressure, you know, like, positional pressure monster. Um, basically good at all the, you know, and, and, and good at getting creative in the scrap and kind of making you feel a little bit silly. Mm -hmm. Good at a lot of things that Kakarot is good at. And I was like, well, that's a really interesting way to put that. Um, mm. Oh, my God. How did, how did that four even? Oh! Oh! Oh, my God! Dude, Fred walling Fox out with these small little hitboxes. Just insane. <sighs> yeah, that, that comparison is very interesting. I think the bullet points, when you list it like that, I can see it making sense. I think overall... It's not the first thing you think. It's not the first thing that I think. I think Cactuar in particular is kind of known for, like, maybe standing still in particular. Right. Like, really um, kind of make you face yourself. Mm -hmm. I, I think that's what his skill is. And Franz, I feel like, is a bit more... Uh, 
I think I think he is a little more imposing himself onto you in that way, mm -hmm. as a, like mm -hmm. a high level point. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. regardless, I'll have to think about that more. But you know, back back to back to this match. You know, it's yes. it's still so, <laughs> it's just so, it's just so crazy. And it's, it's also so very close. Crazy dude, it's so <laughs> crazy. Yeah, Fran's just policing uh. center stage right now. Just kind of, kind of establishing the perimeter, dude. Right, establishing right. this perimeter. And I, I do like what Fat Goku. Okay, well, hold on. Whoa, whoa, that was that was a read. Yeah. Okay. Um, I, I do like that Fat Goku. Well, let's see if we. Okay. So, yeah, I, I think play the run and gun a little bit, but okay, not enough there. That's not gonna be enough. the stock. So, all right, now, now if you're Fat Goku, you're forced to make the move, obviously. So, let's see what he's got. You'd love to. Yeah, it's it's um. I guess, okay. yeah, you're really seeing Fat Goku try to, yeah, he's prioritized getting Franz oh. this up smash kill percent, and Franz is just going to take that pill damage where he can get it. Oh, okay, I can't that believe that hit. Huge. This the, should be... Uh, mm, yeah, and you're going to have to forward throw now and kind of give Franz... That was really nice, though. So this should be a KO because, yeah, up he just does not go very far. No, it doesn't. Last stock here. Fat Goku definitely playing a lot more solid, but missing the dash back. Oh, great tech chase there. Oh, yeah, friends right there trying to bait out the air dodge. Doesn't get it. Oh, and then there into the corner. Be <gasps> careful. Yeah, that cape will just end it. Covering multiple options with the upper and a down smash. Ooh, no ledge dash there, but that's okay. But still a big percent differential. Oh, dude. I... These nair ins are actually kind of scary. And oh, oh, that's dangerous. Whoa. That actually worked out for friends. Oh, the reversal? Okay, yeah. Uh, Fat Goku's not really gotten any damage so far. A lucky Shine Clank right there. Still nothing from Fat Goku's side, and a whiffed up tilt is going wow. to take the stock. This is the part of the bracket where we do begin playing best of five sets to get into, so I guess it's like top 96 is best of five, if I'm, if I'm doing my math correctly. Correct. So the winner of this makes top 64 winner side. Mm-hmm. But All now right. being down 2-0, you know, this is one of those matchups where, like, I don't know how much of a, t a chain grab monster uh, Franz is going to be on, like, spaces Ooh. Mm -hmm. in particular. But now you kind of have that fear in the back of your mind, potentially, where it's like, oh, do I have to deal with FD? I don't know. Oh, I, 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 I think awesome. you should be worried about FD if you're Fat Goku. So well, even if you take this 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 match, it's going to be scary going forward. Right, but he's definitely picked it up. Just handling business a lot more sharply here this game. Yeah, so far so good. And okay, wow. Like that shine. Oh, but keeping the jump, mm -hmm. but the coverage from Fat Goku punishing the uh, the ledge get up. And I, I I like the adaptation there because in the last game. Fat Goku did a roll on, you know, when he didn't have to. Just a get up, up smash would have been better. And yep. so even there, um, slowly building the advantage. And you can see that happen sometimes when you have like the top tier versus the mid tier or whatever, mm -hmm. right? So let's see if that happens for Franz. Right now, it looks like it, it's kind of three, maybe even four stock like pacing for, for Fat Goku. Unless yeah. Franz does something right now. Whoa. As I, we say I, that. I wasn't even sure if Cape would, uh, would reach at that height. It, it's really high. Really high, right? I think Dr. Mario is supposed to have a bigger Cape than Mario. That's, I think it says that in the, the trophy descriptions in the game somewhere, so. <laughs> really? Hey, well, you know, because when you're a kid and you don't know about, you know, I don't know, a lot. <laughs> yeah. You're like, the game. Well, what makes these characters different? One of them's got a pill instead of the fireball. And I think you're like, people tell you like, oh, Mario's faster, but Doc has a bigger cape. Right, 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 right. <laughs> sure. Ooh. Ooh, I like that up air attempt from Fat Goku. Yeah, still still hunting for the hit. I don't think the edge guard is going to come here. Yeah, it's really hard to edge guard Dr. Mario when uh, you come from that high. But tournament winner, going to cost him the stock. Mm -hmm. I'm liking, you know, on Fat Goku's end, I will say I'm liking that Ooh. he's just mixing in a lot more, um, like, aggressive full hops. Not, like, full aggression, but, like, uh, you know, doing them in places where it's like, okay, if Franz gets under me with something I can punish, I'm going to actually just commit with the down air or something like that. Mm -hmm. I feel like mm -hmm. there's been a lot more of those really good full hops, the ones that are really frustrating to deal with, Yep. Uh, in this game than, than either game <gasps> one or two. Oh, no. 
Yeah, no, um, Blur actually pointed that out during doubles as well. Blur um, kind of uh, put Fat Goku as one of the best full hoppers, you know, wow. just picking uh, picking his spots. Yeah, choosing when to come down with the full hop back air right. versus an empty land and punish like the, the um, just whatever the opponent does. Like, it seems like Fat Goku's pretty good at that, and yeah. that game in particular did a good job. Yeah. Well, so. this is going to be the FD game, you know, potentially the first of two. And now is the question, how well does France have this unlock? And let me tell you, this should be death. Or at least very close, and I think okay, one now good you down sign. Throw. Oh, down throw. Miss, yeah, miss okay, so you know about that. Yeah, knows that, but, you know, France knows, obviously knows the percent, is going to go for it. Oh, oh, that was clean. Doesn't even Dude. need the cape there. Dude. Dude. So one sign is that when France got the low percent grab, Instant up throw. Oh, okay, ah. that's just the miss input, of course. But Probably meant up throw, mm -hmm. yeah. Instant, yep. um, instant throw, no pummel, no chance of, like, it kind of breaking out. And so, like, I feel like the little things really do add up. It's like they do. you don't want to give your opponent even one chance to get out. And Fran's doing a great job of that so far. So far, uh, this stock, Fed Goku has had some good techs, I will say. Just, like, not giving Franz a lot of the down smash tech chases that Franz has been looking for. Yep. And that up smash, that might be uh, Fat Goku's ticket back into this game. Fat Goku, you know, for being one of the best full hoppers, definitely also one of the best up smashers. Fat Goku, famous for really just loving raw up smash and neutral. This is going to be an up throw forward That's going to be it. That mm -hmm. is always basically going to combo. I know there's a DI that you can do, like, slight DI behind that does make it a bit trickier, but ultimately they can still get it. Yep. And the thing with this matchup, especially on this stage, is that, like, this is the very common matchup of neutral versus punish, uh -oh. and then look at this. Okay, France finally making a mistake, but it doesn't matter. It gets the follow-up afterward. Yeah. You're hearing the A's in the chat. There we go. Down throw. Wow. And misses the, uh, the down throw regrab, but gets down smash on the Tekken plays anyway. It's tough. That is rough, dude. Yeah, I mean, France has... Oh, oh. oh this actually just could be it, right? That, Here, be, that yeah, is it. it. That is France. a defibrillator to the chest. Clear. Mm. You Friend, have dude. been prescribed to get off the stage. That's right. Man, <laughs> what a beast. Friends like Dude, this guy just this guy just every tournament he just puts more top player wins on his resume. Just such a phenomenal player, such a scary Dr. Mario. Let me let me actually